Hi there. This is another flip through. This is the second uh, junk journal I made from a digital download last fall. And the download is from Back to the Source PL. That's her Etsy shop. This is called Watercolor Roses. And it's really soft, beautiful, pearly pink, neutral tones with beige backgrounds, very pretty. This is just some fabric I had, and also this. These are pieces that I had from making leather bracelets, so they're kind of a, a rivet or a brad that you drive through, clear through. I went ahead and made this into a trifold journal after watching Julie at Camellia Crafts because I thought I could load it up a little bit more. And this has a pocket on the back with some pretty things in it. Look how beautiful that is. Now some of these um, I actually printed when I started just on HP brochure paper, but because I was doubling it up, or in this case, adding it to chipboard, I glued and taped the paper to both sides of chipboard. It was still pretty sturdy. So here's a little pearly branch with a key. There's a little pocket in here for another tag. And that's right in, in against the chipboard. And then I glue the papers on it. And this, I actually, that's a double-sided one where I use the craft paper on the back. So a lot of these, as I got a little bit smarter, I'd use cardstock and print front and back. So here's another fun little pocket here. Kind of mimics what's up here, as does. There's a key right here and a key here. This is a little 12 by 12 inch one page wonder that I folded and put together. And I just love the antiquiness, even though it's mostly beiges, it goes so well with this. Every time I make these, they turn out different. So somehow I did this where it has an extra flap here so it folds over on itself. Usually they would be, this would be the end right here. So it'd just be a booklet, but I liked that this kept going. Then we have a pocket. It's an envelope from Temu. And I've got one of my Tim Holtz ideologies. Chipboards live for the moments you cannot put into words. And a little booklet. The booklets to me have been the funnest things to make. In fact, I think I'm gonna to try to learn more, I guess about doing the signatures um, or making actual books. Because I don't know why, they're just fascinating. So here's the inside of that um, eyelet. It's not an eyelet, I guess a rivet that I put in. Um, the sides here, these are. this is washi tape, which if I did it again, I would use some that's wider so it could go under this better. It's just barely under it. And I've had to glue these a few times, but they seem pretty secure now. But that is something. Washi tape's not as sturdy as like the fabric ribbon I've shown you on some other ones. So here again, here's a flip, little flip pocket that was uh, glued against the chipboard and then the background paper was laid over it. So it's just kind of a cute little thing. This is made from a really small paper bag. So it's my first attempt at a waterfall, uh, which doesn't work super well because of this being in the way, but it's still kind of neat because it gives it, it's just a, a beautiful play of colors and composition, I think. And you can still lift these up and take a peek at the pretty papers. Um, if you folded them clear back, you could actually, you know, journal something in there if you want to, especially down here. But like I said, I realized that kind of held it down, but it sure made a neat header for this part. <clears throat> 
And then you go over here, and again, here's another marker where I've uh, adhered the beautiful graphic to the parchment background. And this is just some old upholstery trim that I happen to have. So it goes back together like that. This is a tag a friend gave me. And I just thought the colors went really nice with this, so I used them with it. This was fun because I had this tag. Okay, and then here was fabric, just like it. Two different sources, just happened to have them. So there is watercolor roses done in a trifold journal with a digital download. There you go. Give it a try, it's a lot of fun.